Are you struggling to implement your own date format for the shiny new date picker from Material 2? You're not alone. Today, we're gonna tackle this issue together and get your date picker working just the way you want it. I totally understand how frustrating it can be when you're following documentation, but things just don't seem to work. Many developers face similar challenges when customizing components. You're definitely in good company. Let's dive into the specific question at hand. One user asked, how do I implement MD date formats for my date picker? They provided some code snippets, but ran into an error stating that the date input is null. Sound familiar? Let's break this down. So what's going on here? The error indicates that the date input is not being recognized properly. The documentation mentions that the type can be anything, which can be confusing. Let's clarify this and find a solution. And stick around. At the end of this video, I'll share a quick tip that can save you time and headaches when working with date formats. To implement custom date formats for the date picker, the user should first define their own date formats. This can be done by creating a new constant that extends the default formats. Next, the user needs to ensure that they provide this custom date format in the provider's array of their Angular module. This is crucial for the date picker to recognize the new formats. After setting up the providers, the user should check the implementation of the parse function. It should correctly handle the input format specified earlier. Finally, the user should test the date picker to ensure that it correctly displays and parses dates using the new formats. This can be done by running the application and interacting with the date picker. Fun fact, did you know that the first date picker was just a simple text field? We've come a long way in making date selection easier and more user-friendly. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution suggests modifying your code by replacing the line that provides the date adapter. Instead of using useValue, you should use useClass for the native date adapter, as it is a class and not a constant. This change should fix the error related to the parse function. The user also mentions that they couldn't replicate the date input as null error. However, if you encounter it, you can define the date input in the parse object with a valid format, such as year, month, and day, or use a string format like YYYYMMDD. Now, let's shift our focus to a different response. An alternative approach suggests that to implement custom date formats, you should create your own MD date formats and date adapter. Specifically, replace the existing date adapter provider with a class reference instead of a value. Additionally, the user has shared a project link demonstrating how to implement these custom formats using moment.js for better date representation. This implementation is fully customizable to meet your specific needs. Here's the tip I promised. Always test your date parsing function with various date formats to ensure it works as expected. This can save you a lot of debugging time. And there you have it. With these steps, you should be able to implement your own date format for the date picker successfully. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips and tricks.